Now, in the formation of the comparative and superlative degree, let us look at rule number two. The rule number two says, when the positive, when it ends in E, only R and ST are added to form comparative and superlative. As I told you, you do not need to remember the rules. As you read along, write along, it will come correctly. So we need to read a lot. So we are going to look at rule number two. Rule number two. The rule number two says when the positives, when the positive ends, when the positive ends in, when the positive ends in E. When it ends in E, what happens? Only ends in E, only R. And ST. When it ends in E, R and ST are added. R and ST. R and ST are added to the comparative and the superlative to form. R added. Added to form, form the comparative and superlative and superlative. Okay, that's what we are going to do. Now, you have positive, comparative, superlative. Okay. Positive, comparative, superlative. Now, we put them into boxes so we can look clearly. What are we doing? And superlative. Okay. Now, what did we say? When the positive ends in E, R and ST are added. R and ST added to comparative and superlative to, to form the spellings correctly. Okay, now let's look at the first one I have here is able. First, able, brave, able, Brave, all ends in E. Fine. All ends in E. Noble. True. And finally, we have wise. All the capacitive are ending in E. That's what we need to look at. When the positives ends in E, what we need to do. To form the comparative to one, we add R. So, now, 
able. So first, able, brave, fine, noble, true, and wise. Okay, now to form the superlative, we add e able abler. R only R is added to form the abler, braver, finer, nobler, truer, and wiser. Okay, now let's look at the Formation of superlative in one able brave fine noble true. And finally, wise. How do we form? We form the superlative by adding st. So, a b a blessed. You just add st. Bravest. St. Finest. Noblest. Truest and finally wisest. We form the superlative by adding st. Now, the second rule says when the positive ends in e, the comparative is formed by adding r and the superlative is formed by adding st. Okay, now let's look at the whole thing and read it aloud. Positive, able, abler, ablest, brave, braver, bravest, fine, finer, finest, noble, nobler, noblest, true, truer, truest, wise, wiser, wisest. We learned the rule number two in forming the comparative. If the positive ends in a, a E, we add R to form the comparative and we add ST to form the superlative. That is rule number two. So now we know how to, how rule number two goes in the three degrees of comparison of adjectives.